So this loud knocking, knock, knock, knock. I'm, I've got flying guys with all the censored up to the gills as robots, and that means microphones. And I hear, dunk, dunk, dunk. Maybe it's something. There. <laughs> Look at the humans right there. Humans are right there. And I was also mad that the dogs were determining if the people were robots inside the base. Things to happen outside the base. I see. I see. So, I, so yeah, so I like that the dogs smell the human because if it smells mm -hmm. like a human, it smells like a human. If it smells like a or like a machine, that is not a human. Mm -hmm. But the the intruder, the potential intruder, that they're already inside. So you're, you're saying it needs to happen outside that door, right? So it would be nice if there was maybe a man trap situation, but if there's if it's impossible to create a man trap, then it just has to happen outside. And what's a man trap? Man trap is like an airlock where you have two doors and person walks into the first one, closes, you do all your checks. If they fail the checks, then they cannot get into the base through the second door. Ah. And if they pass the checks, then you close this, open this, they can go in. I see. So the dogs and the handler should be hanging out inside the man trap. They sniff them in there, trap. and the dog's like, bark, bark, bark. Then That's everyone right. inside the base is still safe, and they'd be like, mm, you don't come inside. That's right. I see. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Agreed. Yeah, agreed. That, mm -hmm. That's what should happen. Right. So I guess the man trap also helps with infrared. Just, just another stopgap. That's right. Inside the man trap's got to be full. you gotta, you got to send in cool air at ambient mm -hmm. into the man trap. So when you open the outside door, it's invisible to IR. And, and when, one, you never have two doors open at the same time. It's always just one door closes mm -hmm. and then the next door can open. That's right. Mm. Yeah, man, there would need to be some cycling time too because as soon as people walk in there, stuff happens, the air might heat up. You may glow. So now you got to cool it back down. Oh, what a pain. But, I mean, what else are you going to do? I just got to do. It can't be seen with machines. Right. Got a good sign-in sheet. Can't lie on that. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. He signs it with like a stubby little bit of piece of pencil, or maybe a cigarette. I can't tell. Any like flicks it away. Like that's yeah. uh, that's not a secure system. Right. It's good to have the system of some type, but I mean, if somebody is a spy, they're just gonna if they already got this far. <laughs> also, I don't know if you can see it here, but like that door is not gas safe. Let's go back. Like and a, stay a look. machine just throws in a gas grenade. Heck, heck even oh. into this part, like right, and that's then you right, just yeah. Tear gas everyone out. That's right, because this this is the gap right here. Good against uh, keeping people out or maybe robots out because it's a heavy metal door, but mm -hmm. exposed to the atmosphere outside. So you just no throw good. gas grenades down here. I mean, like lethal stuff. That's right. Yeah, you and just the, let, you smoke them out. Yep. Yeah. And let's watch these procedures fail. So Kyle Reese hears the dogs. That means the thing that set the dogs off is in the base. He's in. He's already in. Yeah, he's done. And then, and then this guy on the, the the mounted machine gun, who's supposed to be the one, if the dogs get set off the door. And where is he? Right here. Yeah. He's asleep at the wheel. That's right. He's got his hands on it, but it's too slow. He needs to be pointed at the door and ready to rock. It's right. Complacency. It's, yeah. And if you take out a human in the process, well, that first of all, that decision has to be made beforehand. I think mm -hmm. that the if if the dogs are set off, then you just gun everyone down. You take out some humans. That really sucks. But you take out the HK. If you hesitate, then this is what happens, and it's way worse. The HK just walks through your base, people right. up. So the it's complete procedure problems. Ah, that's right. <laughs> And so, like, procedure problems, people like poo-poo, whatever, but, like, actually, this is life-saving. Right. Having the so proper man trap, having the proper door seals, having the dogs in the right place, like, the correct right. sequence of, if I hear an alarm, what do I do? Right. right. This guy needs to be trained up. What do I do about sound? What, what do I do looking? about IR? Because, like, he has to rotate this thing around, which means that he wasn't pointing at the door. But what is that right. covering besides the door? It has to be covering the door. Why would you have such a huge machine gun except to take out HKs at the door? Right. Otherwise, that's outside. That's right. That's right. 
So, I mean, it's just a procedures fail left and right. Even if this isn't one of the advanced HKs that looks exactly like a human, mm -hmm. which it kind of kind of looks like it does. Like, there was there was going to be problems. There was going to be problems. And it's not like technological problems. It's mm -hmm. not like. I mean, gosh, it's just administrative. It's just, let's mm -hmm. make some rules for how this door works, what everyone needs to do around the door, and then we're right. good. And you need complete buy-in from all of compliance. the people there. If they think it's like busy work or like not important, then you're going to get, you know, they're going to have problems. Uh, like putting chemicals in the fume hood. If people are like, eh, I don't care, it's fine. Like, mm, that's how you get chemicals around the lab and you knock over by accident. Like, just, right. just, just leave it in the right place. Leave it in the right place. So it looked like maybe they had all the all the parts Oof. of a secure door, Oof. but it just Gosh. wasn't coordinated. It only needs to be insecure, unsecure. It only needs to be insecure once. That's so right. HK will walk through and then wipe out whatever humans are there. Right, because this is once you get inside, this is what you got. And they're good at like fodder and like lower half of the body human shields, but right. if you need an adult to be protected while they're shooting, then mm -hmm. gosh. Look at this laser beam. Yep. I wonder if it's actually plasma. The laser is ripping through there through the air, ionizing the gas. Mm -hmm. It would like sizzle, sizzle and crack. Mm -hmm. Just just terrifying sounds. Just Yeah, if it's at high energy enough to like kill people, mm -hmm. it might thunderclap. Might exactly. clap back. Plus that thunderclap makes ozone, a headache, no, it doesn't feel good. That's right. You get that smell of ozone, which you then start to associate with death. If I don't you want to associate that with death. Oof. Mm. So in summary, get door your procedures. procedures down. Door procedures, entrance procedures, right. 